we are going to do some shoulder banded U's to Y's. And so with this, depending on how long your band is, will determine what height you have this. I don't typically do this as much on the on like a lower anchor point, um, just because it's gonna make it a little bit harder, especially as you get to that Y position, unless your band is really long. So we're looking for like chest height or higher. I have this really good anchor point, so I'm gonna utilize that. But what we're gonna do is we're gonna kinda start off like a face pull. So you're gonna have your hands in front of you and then you're gonna pull your arms back into a U position here. We're gonna hold this for a second. We're gonna make sure we're not arching our back. We're keeping our core nice and engaged and our ribs um, over stacked over our pelvis here. From this position, we're gonna slowly bring those arms up into the Y, again, holding here, making sure that you're not letting those arms come forward. We wanna keep them back against the resistance as best as possible. And then we're gonna to return to that U. We're going to repeat, if you can, without stopping. So up and then down, up and then down. We wanna make sure that we're not like looking up or looking down. We want to have good vision straight forward, and this is going to hold our body in good posture. And then we're going to come out of that. It's a great exercise to do to really challenge those rotator cuff muscles above shoulder height. So we're starting at shoulder height and then adding movement as we're doing this. It's not your basic like lower or those W's. We are out here and then we're maintaining resistance the entire time. Out at the side, maintaining resistance as we reach up and back down. It's a great one for good shoulder health.